guys, Nikki here. Welcome to my art channel, Nikki D Art. Thanks for joining me today. Hope you're all well. First colour I'm using is Palescent Teal. It's a boom gel. And this one, it's a new This Little Piggy TLP pigment called Supernova. It's a duo tone. It goes from a bubblegum pink to a deep indigo blue colour shift. And that's a Mali Ring Neck Blue, also Boom Gel. A little bit more Supernova. And that's Lily Pilly Pink in um, Boom Gel too. And I'm swiping with uh, Atelier Metallic Copper, Atelier Interactive Metallic Copper. And my canvas is a 16 inch square canvas. And I'm um, what I'm going for today, I wanted um, sort of a lot of negative space and to do some scoops and drags, so sort of a, a curvy sort of shape. I wasn't really sure what shape I was going to go for. Sometimes it, as you're sort of swiping, you, you decide it how it's you know how it's going. I knew I was going to swipe one way and then swipe the other and then then scoop using my palette knife and see where we go from there. But you need to do scoop and drags while you've got the thickness of the paint. So you do it before you spin out. So when you see me put the palette knife in, you'll see how there's the depth of the paint. You've got plenty of paint to play around with basically. Once you've spun out, you risk having a, a bare canvas. You need the thickness of the paint. And then you can play around with paint and drag it wherever you want to. But it's good to drag the cells and then you get sort of a nice effect. This supernova, I'll put one photo without my camera flash and then I'll put a, a photo with the camera flash and the camera flash it just looks all blue, you can't see any pink at all and that is how it is when you're, for instance, if it's on the wall as you're, if you move to one side it will look pink and then as you change direction and walk around the piece it changes to blue, it's, um, I love these duo tone colours such a nice colour, it's uh, hopefully going to be released in the new year there's going to be, I think there's eight new this little piggy pigments i think some of them might not be released until valentine's day but uh, some might be released in the new year but yeah we've already um highlighted the mosh which was the neon yellow orange that was the first of the new one releases and this is the second one of the new soon to be released pigments so more pigments to come to show you, more sneak peeks. I'll put some Christmas music on for you now and let you watch and come back to you in a while.
So hopefully you can see what I mean about the pink and then the blue. See that pale pink there? And then it goes, yeah, you can see it goes deep blue. It's just gorgeous. It's so shimmery. And there, that's no flash at all on my camera. So it just looks blue, uh, sorry, not blue, pink. You can see a little bit of the um, metallic blue. But you can still see the pink and that's no flash whatsoever that's just a still photo without any camera flash or any filters or anything and then that's the 
<laughs> the flash on, still no filters, but I, I just turned the flash on as you can see the little um, glow in the center. So you see what I mean, how blue the, t the tone changes. And this is my second video for you today. Uh, it's a transferred swipe. So the colors I've used are golden iridescent gold fine and golden interference gold. And I'm swiping with, um, I believe it's blue black, Atelier blue black. It's either that or Payne's grey. I will double check and put it in um, the description box below. And I'm using a little mini dustpan to apply the swipe with. And I wanted my first swipe to be sort of minimal colours and then the the other swipe that are transfer swipe that I put over the top of it will have um, some turquoise in it as well. So I quite like how that ribbon turned out so I'm not going to add any more to that one. Now the colours I'm going to be adding shortly for the, the next transfer swipe uh, it's Jo Sonia Aqua and I also added a little bit of and I can't remember, I think it was Turquoise Deep by Holcroft. As I said, I'll double check and put it in the description box below. Just click on the video title and it will take you straight there. But um, I'm almost certain I, I did that to make it a bit darker. And then the what looks like navy that I put on is Joe Sonia Payne's Grey. And I mixed in a bit of Pebio Iridescent Blue Black. To get some nice shimmer and to um, give you that sort of two-tone effect and I also used golden iridescent gold fine and I'm swiping this time with Atelier metallic copper there's the gold fine which I'm um, scraping the bottom I haven't got a lot of and that's the uh, Payne's grey mixed with the uh, Pebio iridescent blue black Now, my Atelier Copper was too thick, um, and as you can see, the, the cells aren't coming up, so I just keep blowing on it, so obviously I'll fast forward and cut a little bit out, and then I'll put it to one side for them to develop. They will eventually develop, but they just take a little bit longer to come through. But uh, yeah, it was, uh, was a little bit too thick. But it's, you've got to try and find the happy medium because if it's too thin, then your cells break up. So, yeah, it's you've got to find that happy medium. Right, I'll put some more music on for you. Chilling and having a good, good time Just come in the visit. No, he wouldn't miss this in Christmas times. Oh, and the sun said it is just get better on a blanket with the skyline painted in blue. Ooh, yeah, that's what we do. We'll be chilling and having a good, good time.
Santa's gonna come and join us in this song. Oh, yeah. So what you see me doing at the moment, I'm just dipping my wooden skewer into the cell activator. Now I'm not sure if I said metallic copper before for this cell activator, it isn't. It's PBO um, iridescent precious gold. I'm not sure why I said copper. <laughs> Sorry about that buzz, I've just turned my notifications off. So I like these two swipes, I think it looks quite three dimensional having the, the paler one down first. And I like how the ribbons, although there's only two ribbons, I like how they came out. I like the folds in it. Just popping some bubbles, you have to be very careful when you, um, you torch though that you don't hold it in one place for too long because it can form a skin. Look at those folds, the ribbons, it's so nice. Nice and shimmery. Oh, I forgot to say, this piece is a 16 inch round canvas. I forgot to mention that before. Nice lace in there. And I love those lines there. Sorry if you can hear that noise in the background. That's <laughs> my husband and my dog tick topping, making a lot of noise. I've just sent them away. <laughs> well, I'd like to thank everybody for all your support this year. I appreciate every single one of you and all the lovely comments. You're all amazing. Thank you so much. And I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas and try and forget what's going on in the world for a few hours and spend it with your loved ones and hold them tight and have a really good Christmas. Everybody stay safe, take care and enjoy your day. See you soon everybody, thanks so much, bye.